momento, pero todavía no empecé el juego. A lot of adrenaline, uh, but at the same time excited to see uh, a lot of my friends on the other side and uh, just excited to, you know, play the game tonight against them. Uh, but we have to see until that first pitch comes. Garrett, was the most difficult thing about the trade, getting adjusted to a new team, new environment, new city? I think the most difficult thing was uh, adjusting to new faces and at the same time leaving a lot of friends behind, uh, starting a new chapter in my career. But at the same time, Minnesota uh, was really welcoming. Uh, like I said before, the front office, uh, I knew a lot of people in this clubhouse as well that I played with, that I met before. And uh, so that was really comfor comforting for me. Gary, you set the bar so high your first couple of years with those numbers, and then there were some struggles, a lot of criticism from fans, media. Was it almost a relief to get away from the, the criticism, which was severe at times? No, that's part of the You know, that's part of the game. It happens to every baseball player. Um, pitchers, they make their adjustments. We as hitters, we have to make our own adjustments as well. Uh, I had a couple of bad years, and, and that's about it. I got traded, and, and now I'm getting better, and I'm just moving forward. Gary, this is really the first time we've got to see you since the trade happened. A lot of us were kind of shocked when it happened. What was your initial reaction? You know, I, I think it was just changing my mentality of, you know, I'm not a Yankee anymore. Now I'm a, I'm a twin. Uh, turn the page, move forward. What, if anything, do you miss about New York? <laughs> my teammate, my teammates, uh, like I said before, it's uh, other relationships built throughout the years, minor leagues, big leagues, and uh, I miss the chefs over there. <laughs>